Now, the Ghana-Japan Business Promotion Committee has been inaugurated to facilitate mutual investment trade and business interests between both countries. CEO of the Ghana Investment Promotion Center, Yofi Grant, urged Japan to take advantage and partner local businesses to make Ghana a manufacturing hub in West Africa. The Ghana-Japan Business Promotion Committee is a high-level partnership mechanism aimed at driving strategic economic partnerships between both countries. It will be composed of high-level Ghanaian government representatives and that of Japan. The local representatives are from the trade and industry, finance, foreign affairs and regional integration, business development ministries, and the Ghana Investment Promotion Center. Members of the Japanese side will be from the embassy, Jetro, JICA, and the Japanese private sector. The committee, which will be co-chaired by the CEO of the Ghana Investment Promotion Center and the Japanese ambassador to Ghana, will promote Ghana as an entry point into Africa, an investment hub to Japanese companies. The CEO of GIPC, Yofi Grant, entreated the Japanese to take advantage of government flagship programs by partnering local businesses to thrive. This particular committee is to make sure that we have a clear and open path where we have mutual beneficiation resulting from the relationship that we can create and the efficiencies that we can create in having the investment capital flow without impediments and, you know, a bureaucratic uh, bottlenecks, etc. The Japanese ambassador to Ghana, Himino Chutomo, explained some challenges confronting their businesses in Ghana and encouraged government to improve their business climate. The Japanese businesses need to know the reality, not only you know, rosy pictures, but reality. Because once they come here, it is a big commitment. So it's better for them to know what they really expect and also to know there are challenges, but there are ways to overcome the challenges. The committee's meetings will be held biannually in Accra.